Hey, it's Andrew at the Chugach National Forest Avalanche Center. It's March 16th and we're riding around in the front side of Seattle Ridge here, just kind of sticking in the flats. This round of sort of stormy weather is moving in. It's kept the ridge in the clouds for most of the day, so we weren't really feeling good about getting up and over. We did dig a pit about halfway up the up track at our high point, about 1,800 feet. And what we saw was this new snow, snow had settled out to about two and a half to three feet of snow on the ground and it's sitting on top of really weak surfaces. So on that, on that pit, we were on an east aspect and there was a small layer of surface ore on top of a crust and we got poor test results in the pit. And just two days ago on Thursday, we saw nine human triggered avalanches up here in Turnigan Pass, another skier triggered avalanche at Girdwood yesterday. And based on what we're seeing in the pit, we're expecting it to be reactive today and continue through the weekend. The other thing we're going to be looking out for is with a new round of snow and wind on the way, smaller avalanches filling near the surface. Um, so it's kind of dangerous conditions right now. We just got a whole lot of snow this week. We're going to want to give that some time to settle out before we start poking out into bigger terrain. And you can get more info at chugachavalanche.org.